Hi, it's Jennifer at Jennifer at Home, and I'm so happy you're here today because today my husband, Alan, and I are going to be decorating for Christmas. We're going to be putting up our Christmas trees. So I have my Hallmark Christmas movie on in the background. I have just made some hot chocolate, and we have the Christmas music ready to go. Let's get started and putting up and decorating our Christmas trees. It is time to get started with our Christmas decorating. We're gonna move the chair. I have all of the decorations set out and I've already cleaned and dusted everything. The window blinds are all clean and dusted. And now it's time to get started with our decorating. Alan just brought out the tree. We're gonna get everything taken out and laid out and then we'll get the tree put together. That's always the first thing we start with after we do our hot cocoa bar. searched and searched for a really nice long garland but everything was so short and I ended up finding this beautiful yarn at Hobby Lobby. It's 28 yards. It's nice and soft and fluffy and it's the exact color I was looking for. It was $6.99 but it was on sale so it was even less than that and now I have enough garland to do the entire Christmas tree. So if you're looking for a garland, you may want to check out the yarn department at Hobby Lobby or your local craft store. And this is what the yarn garland looks like on the tree. I have some of my most favorite rustic natural decorations for the Christmas tree. Is an ornament I made of our house. It's just a salt dough and then I cut out all of the elements of our house and made it into an ornament the first year we lived here. Now it proudly hangs on our tree every year. We're getting close friends. I don't want to give it all away. We're not done yet. That's just a sneak peek. We pretty much have the tree done in the living room, and now we're gonna go on and do some other decorating around the room. Now that the living room Christmas tree is done, we're moving on to the dining room tree. Alan is gonna get it unboxed and we'll get it all set up. Our family tree in the dining room is complete. We have it all decorated and ready for Christmas. These are the most special ornaments that we have because they have stood the test of time. We have had these for so many years. They're special ornaments that were my husband Alan's when he was a small child. And some of his favorite collectible ornaments from a Christmas story. and all of the ornaments that our kids made while they were growing up. They're all very special. From a little mouse thumbprint, to pictures and little ornaments that the kids have made over the years. This was my special ornament that was a gift from my Aunt Barbara when I was little. It's Raggedy Ann and it's dated on the back, 1975. Alan has his little smoker ornament here. 
Back when we were very young and we couldn't afford to buy ornaments, I made ornaments for the whole family. They were all sewn by hand. This is an ornament from my sister when I was young. She gave this back to me in the 1980s. More Christmas story ornaments. More ornaments from Alan's childhood. Travels that Alan made when he was in the military. There's a camel from the desert. Many, many happy memories. We love to put this tree in the dining room so that when our family comes at the time of the holidays, we can share all these ornaments and admire them and look at them while we're having dinner together. It's very, very special. We already have two other trees put up and now we're gonna put the third tree up in our bedroom. It's always nice to look at the tree at night with the lights on when we're snuggled up in bed we we'll be watching a Christmas movie on the TV on the Hallmark Channel or Lifetime Channel. I have my decorations there ready to put on the tree. Alan's going to get it put together real quick and then we'll start decorating. And here is our bedroom Christmas tree. I call this the photo tree because last year I made a video where I made all of these photo tags to hang on the tree. Memories that we had throughout the entire year. I'll have that video come up at the end of this video so that if you'd like to see it and make photo tags for your Christmas tree, you can easily find that video. So many fun, special family memories. I have a little wooden star at the top and some little stockings and little mittens all over the tree. This tree is so special because every time I enter or exit my room or when I'm just relaxing and reading a book in the corner chair, I can always have these wonderful memories to look at. We just had our brand new carpet installed just in time to decorate for Christmas. I like to keep my bedroom nice and calm and serene and relaxing. All of the colors are nice, soft neutrals. Alan and I had so much fun putting up these Christmas trees and getting them all decorated. We love having decorations all over our house and I look forward to all of the upcoming videos we have with all of the cooking and baking and Christmas activities and more decorating and even a home tour. I would love for you to subscribe so you can come back and join us and don't forget to hit the notification bell and the thumbs up button and we'll see you next time.